Hello everyone, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you so much for tuning in to my channel today. In today's video, I'm going to be working in my creative journal. So if you're interested in seeing this, please be sure to stay tuned. Okay, you guys, I have my happy planner and this book here really serves me no purpose other than a creative outlet, which sometimes we need. <laughs> and today felt like one of those days where I just needed to play with some stickers. So here we are. I'm going to be using this book from the happy planner. It is the Bridgerton book because yeah, I'm actually already tired of waiting for the new one so if they could just hurry up and put it back on that would be amazing so and then i also have this washi which is really just like a neutral i don't know i don't think it says anything but i just like that it had the words on it i felt like that was really you know cool so anyway this is an undated planner. And like I said, I just use it for like a creative outlet. It really serves me no purpose. <laughs> Other than the fact that sometimes your girl just wants to play with stickers and use them creatively. And then if for some reason I would like to ever utilize this planner, I have the ability to do so because it is already ready to go so i really like this like a lot so anyway i hope you all are doing well i am taking full advantage of my summer <laughs> um, being sick caused me to get some very much needed rest um, which you know I appreciate now although now it's really strange because now I'm in this whole like I guess because I was sick it kind of threw my sleeping pattern off so like the day I'm filming this is actually um, it is actually Tuesday morning that I'm filming this. So you guys will see this later on. Normally I do bulk filming, um, but again, since I'm at home, it's a little bit easier to just go ahead and film while I'm, you know, throughout the day. But at least for these kind of videos, my, my budgeting videos, I'll probably still be doing mostly bulk filming just because in that situation it's easier because I already have everything like laid out and ready. So, but anyway, I'm, you know, filming these and I'm like, I can't sleep. Like it's the weirdest thing. Like last night or technically this morning, I didn't go to sleep until like four. The last time I looked at the clock, it was four or five. Like, and if you know me, I'm a like, I'm sleeping nine o'clock kind of girl. <laughs> like 8.30, my phone goes on sleep mode, do not disturb, like, because I'm in the bed. I usually take that opportunity to kind of wind down, you know, relax, whatever, read, whatever I'm going to do for the evening. But I like to avoid the distraction of, you know, the phone. So, because I know that I will sit on my phone, which is exactly what I did last night. I will sit on my phone for hours, like watching videos or, you know, I have this farm game that I've been playing. <laughs> so, like, I will sit literally on the phone for hours, especially at nighttime doing absolutely nothing. So at least when it goes on sleep mode or do not disturb, like I don't get those notifications. And so I typically almost just forget my phone is even, you know, in the room. 
which is nice. But for some reason, and I don't know what, why, when, where, how, I have just not, I've just not been able to sleep. It's the strangest thing. And this is like, you know, multiple days in a row. So I'll lay down, prepare to go to sleep, and then I just, I just don't. <laughs> so I'm like, uh, I don't know what this is, you guys, but I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. Uh, I thought I wanted to use this, but I don't. It's like a little crown. But yeah, I don't like that. I do love this queen bee, though. There are some other boxes. Oh, apparently I just skipped to like the middle of the book. Hilarious. Uh, okay, yes. These are some very interesting colors here in this book. Let's put this here. Okay. And we will put But yeah, so if anyone else is having some sleep issues, let me know so that I know I'm not alone. Because <laughs> this whole like going to sleep at three, four, five in the morning and then waking up at noon is just not really conducive to my lifestyle. Because... Although, I will say, I do enjoy not getting up at four in the morning, five in the morning, which is what I was doing. So, eh, it's, <laughs> it's kind of like, uh, it's a little, I guess, uh, a little bittersweet, if you will, because I do, I do enjoy sleeping past the wee hours of the morning, so... I don't know, but if I could just, if I could just find a, a, a balance, just a nice, a nice balance, that would be appreciated. Uh, let's add, like, my ice maker is on, so if you hear noise in the background, that's probably what it is. And my neighbors are also neighboring, so there's that. Apparently, everybody's at home today. Some days I'm here all by myself in the building, and then other days other people are home. So today must be a we're all at home kind of day, which is cool. Um, I do live in like a unit of, it's technically four apartments, but I, only three of them are occupied. So I only have, you know, two, uh, two neighbors. I know I mentioned in one of my videos like that, one of my neighbors is like really awesome and very helpful. And he's always, especially like if I go out of town or something like, you know, he'll take out my trash or put my mail in the back like he's dope and then I haven't really talked to the other lady that the one that lives above me but to be perfectly honest with you I don't think I care for her too much <laughs> she's not very good and neighborly um but you know it's just, it's, it's one of those things where it's like, I guess, and I don't know, maybe it's just like my age or 
how my mama raised me. But I try to be considerate of, you know, other people, other people's space, especially because we all have a shared space. But I just don't feel like that is reciprocated very well. Like, prime example, we have our trash bins that we, you know, are to put out weekly. <laughs> and then I pull mine up. I kind of have like, uh, I've created this little corner in the grass that's, you know, not obtrusive to like anything or anyone. So I created this little corner in the grass where I can put my trash cans so that, like I said, they're not in the way. But then like her trash cans will literally be like in the middle of the sidewalk. So I often have to either move them out of the way or kind of tiptoe around them to go check my mailbox because my mailbox is essentially like in front of her, it's in front of her apartment, so. That's kind of a pain in the butt, but you know, I make it work. But it's just little things like that. And I'm like, mm. I mean, even more important than me, just anybody walking down the sidewalk. <laughs> it's like, now they have to kind of make the pimp decision. Do I A, move her things or B, try to tiptoe around them and I don't know. I just feel like people should be more considerate of other people. But again, it's not a huge deal. It's just, you know, it doesn't really make me want to like reach out and befriend you. <laughs> so I'm like, uh, if you're not really that considerate on the street, I don't really know what your friendship skills are like. <laughs> so I'm going to just stay over here. Okay, I like that. And of course, what would a Bridgerton spread be without a diamond? Because you have to have the diamond of the season. All right. Okay, you guys, I think, I think this is it. I really, I like it. I do, I like it. I got some blank spaces, like I said, to write, should I choose to do so. If not, it is definitely really pretty to look at. Let me get this stuff put away. Oops. Uh, where did I put the book? Oh, here we go. Let's pop this back in. Yes, I like it. It's cute. All right, you guys, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe to my channel if you have not already done so. You guys continue to be absolutely amazing and also be safe, be kind, or be quiet, be well, and I'll catch you in the next one.